Well, it really was. Uh, I finally had some makeable birdie putts and, and hit the one on, on 15 a little bit tentative. And on 17, I kind of misread and I tried to pound it in the hole and, and hit it too hard. But I made 30 and 40 footers like they were giving them to me. So it was a great way to finish. Sometime after you were making those 30 and 40 footers, though, you had to think you had a shot to get in and, and, and sneak this thing off, didn't you? Well, I did. I, I birdied 10, 11, 12, and 13, and I looked up, and, and Ian Baker Finch was nine under. And uh, I told my caddy, you know, I don't have that many holes left, so I tried to knock it on 15. Uh, I missed club a little bit. I thought it would come out a little harder. But, uh, you know, 17, it would have been nice to birdie just to keep a, a real good round going. And, and uh, you know, I, I, I just wish uh, a lot more putts would have gone in because it was one great putting day for me. Okay. Uh, you're not going back to the States next week? No, I'm, gonna, I'm two more weeks over here. I'm going to stay over and play in Dutch and then Stockholm. And, uh, you know, uh, I enjoy playing with the European Tour uh, just, just to see how they play. And I played with Constantino Rocca today, and he didn't play that well. But it was just fun, you know, to see, yeah. uh, just to play with different guys. I mean, not that our players aren't fun to play with, but it's fun to go play different kinds of golf courses and, and play with different people. Okay, you, then you like playing this bouncy golf even though you hit it high up in the air? Well, I, I do. I'll be honest, uh, I don't want anything back, but I wish it would have been tougher today. But Ian Baker finishes the two rounds he's played the last Good luck week. next week, okay. Freddie, and thanks oh, for coming. Right. I'll back up to Roger.